We all have to learn how to trust in God more and more and more and more. Now, some of us may trust in God, but we are not at that point where I know for myself. When particular things come comes to my mind to do for people. Sometimes I think, well, maybe they are going to take it in the wrong way, or perhaps they are going to reject what I am saying. Maybe if I do this, they may see it as I am trying to do that. Perhaps they are going to take it in the wrong way. So what I do, and something just popped into my mind. <laughs> so what I do, I may hesitate or not do it. We have to understand that. I believe I made a video on this. Demons and spirits of God can place thoughts into your mind. So when thoughts are coming to your mind, it is coming from an outside source. Anything that goes against the rules and regulations of the Bible, you have to know that it is coming from demons. But if the thoughts does not go against the rules and regulations of God, but go with the rules and regulations of God, then you know that your thoughts are coming from God, the Holy Spirit, spirits of God, so on and so on. So, like I was explaining, many of the time, Thoughts come to my mind that I know that it is coming from spirits of God. Whether it is the Holy Spirit, angels, so on and so on. But like I said, sometimes I doubt. And I'm like, well, maybe they are going to get angry with me if I come and tell them you need to serve God or... Maybe they are going to get mad at me if I pray for them or whatever else. We have to get to the point, even I, we have to get to the point where we stop doubting. I know for myself, I am a person that thinks <laughs> so much and now, usually, <laughs> that may be a good thing there, but sometimes it can hinder me from doing the things that I need to do because I think too much. Sometimes we have to think less and act more, especially when we know that something is coming from God. Because if we don't act upon those thoughts that are coming from God, we are going to miss out on bringing or blessing a person. How can I say this? If we don't act upon the thoughts that are coming from God, what we say or what we do for them is really... If we don't do that or say it, I am confusing myself now. <laughs> if we don't do what God places on our heart to do for people or for whatever else, you pretty much know what I am trying to say. I don't know how to say it <laughs> in words. If we don't do it, 
that person or those people are going to miss out on what God could have done through you. I can't think of what I am trying to say now. Perhaps you may know what I am trying to say. <laughs> so act upon what you know that is coming from God. For instance, there is something that was placed on my heart for, I believe, three months ago. But I am thinking, <laughs> if I do this, perhaps this person is going to take it in the wrong way or believe that I am trying to come at this person in a way where I am not trying to come to him as this person may think that this that I am trying to do this but in truth I am not trying to do that I am just acting upon the thoughts that came to my mind so what I did and what I do now which if I have another opportunity to meet this person I am going to do what have been placed on my heart to do for that person, but I am just going to trust in God. So I pray that this makes sense. And there were other things as well, where it was placed on my heart to do, and when I done it, it worked out so greatly. But the funny thing about that, <laughs> <laughs> no matter how many times we know, even when we know information, even if we have done something so many times, for some reason, when it comes down to God, we doubt it. No matter how many times God have turned things in the right way or turned things great, no matter if we have seen that so many times, we still doubt and hesitate on doing what we need to do or say. Like I said, I need to work on this myself because I do doubt. Look, the way that I am, I don't like trouble. <laughs> I really don't. So what I do even if I get blamed for something, even if things don't turn out well, I'd rather not say anything or do anything that is going to cause trouble. Now, in some cases, you have to say something, I have to do something, but I don't like doing it. I don't like saying it. I'd rather just separate myself from that person or that issue and do my own thing. But in some cases, you have to confront that issue, which I don't like doing because I don't like drama. So I pray that this makes sense. Act upon the thoughts that are coming from God. So if a thought comes to your mind and say, hey, you should punch that person right in their face because they were talking trash about you. You know that is not coming from God. So since it is not coming from God, you need to avoid that thought, not act upon that thought. Because if you do, things are not going to turn out well for you. So I pray that all of this makes sense. God bless.